Steve Sack is best known for his work as editorial cartoonist for the Star Tribune. But did you know that he has a colorful side, too? This is the first time we've had a show of this caliber. Um, and by caliber, I mean just amazing artwork. It's just incredible. The use of mediums, the different content that we have. It's just absolutely incredible. And it's all by one artist. The moment you walk in, it's, well, fun. I knew I was coming to the Art Center to cover a Steve Sack show and I envisioned an extensive collection of cartoons similar to the ones I see in the paper. Boy, was I surprised. Well, this is the other side of Steve. This is what he does in his free time. Um, as you know, artists do multiple things in multiple different ways, and so this is just another extension of himself. The larger three-dimensional pieces are made of paper mache. It's like being able to see a cartoon in 3D. In addition to giving his cartoon takes on politics and culture. Also does the doodle pages for those kids out there that are interested in art. Um, he's been working with the Star Tribune since 1981. And in 2003, 13 actually, he actually won the Pulitzer Prize for editorial cartooning. His work is whimsical, colorful, and always on point. He definitely has a unique style. The big eyes, the over accentuated features, kind of making things more whimsical than they really are in real life. I absolutely cannot imagine anyone walking into the Maple Grove Art Center and not enjoying this exhibit. And it gives people the opportunity to actually see the work of somebody who's well known in our community through the Star Tribune and his work editorially in just a whole new way. It makes that art more accessible. From Maple Grove, Neil Persley, 12 News.